Hello YouTube, that Lego builder here with another mock showcase for you. Um, this is a mech, my first ever mech that I built, um, which I've called Papillon. So, uh, yeah. Like many reviews, we can start with the minifigure. This is the pilot. Um, pretty simple. Some backwards medieval armor in old dark gray. The helmet in the same color, and the body is in the same old dark gray color, but the arms, legs, and knife are in a uh, new dark gray. So you can see a bit of the color difference there. Um, it's got a knife and a gun, so pretty, pretty simple pilots. So come off to the side, and we'll get on to the mech itself. So, I spent about four hours working on this. Um, and I, I really like the look of it, actually. I'm pretty proud of how it turned out. Um, it looks good. It turned out better than I expected it to, considering I went in but to building this without even knowing what it was going to look like. I had no idea. So, um, yeah. You can read a small bio I've put on Flickr along with some high resolution photos but yeah, it's pretty simple um, the main feature is that it kinda has wings I guess so if you just fold up these little triangle plate things uh, this folds up and this folds up and these arms fold out so you can see it kind of has wing type things but I like the look of it when they're down like this so the idea that I have is that this is a mech that would have been used to um, cross harsh terrain like mountains so it has these uh, hooks or they're battle axes really but they're uh, climbing hooks is what I'm calling them so yeah, I guess we can take the arms off and I can show you a bit more easily um, the other feature. So you can see it's just attached by two studs there. It's very delicate, but uh, it's my first ever mech, so that is something that I can work on if I decide to do more in the future. So you can see the body is pretty simple. Um, the legs are also very simple. Uh, they they can move like this. The feet can move around like this, and there's one, well, two joints really. It's a double joint um, here at the knee, so it can move like this, and it can also move like this. And uh, it's not uh, too poseable. Um, it looks good on its own, I think. So, um, yeah, that's, that's about it. It's got a radar dish on the top. Um, it's got these things. I thought it looked cool. It's the back of the legs. <laughs> These don't move. I guess uh, they move again like this, but still not uh, anything too fancy. Uh, I'll try to get it to pose back like it was before. And uh, the wings, I guess I could show you. Um, it's got the cape two blank capes, one on each side, and uh, here's how they move, just one hinge, um, and they can bend a little bit, so it's, I mean I built these wings a while ago, maybe about a month ago, and thinking that I would build a ship, an airship of some kind, 
Um, I thought they would look cool on a starfighter or something, but it turns out they make great mech arms. <laughs> so, yeah, that's, uh, that is Papillon. Um, and uh, for photos, again, look at my Flickr. If you're not subscribed already, be sure to do that. And uh, if you like what you see, give it a like. Um, that label is signing off, and happy building.